So it's the next day here since the last video was filmed, and all the stuff was shipped. In fact, my buddy was nice and put it right there at the shop. And um, that trailer's not gonna be able to fit at all. So my buddy was nice. He, I had bought a semi from him. Like this is a semi that I get to keep, and then I also bought a trailer online, which will hopefully make it only like two trips, whereas it would probably be with that thing a lot more. So first what we're going to do is we're going to get the side-by-sides. And then we're going to get all the quads last. Let me show you guys everything. That truck is still there. I don't know what to buy just, just yet. I'm still thinking about it. But, um, yeah, the one thing I don't like about this map is that this trailer gets glitched really easily. And some t and this, yeah, guys, it's going out of roleplay. This trailer gets glitched in this map. Due to when you buy it, it gets stuck in the fence. So, we're going a bit out of roleplay here just to get this all set up here. Oopsie doodle. Wasn't me, alright, boys. Alright, yeah, it wasn't me. We're gonna agree on that. <laughs> See, guys, it's never me. That's the thing. It's like, it's never me. Alright. Let's fix these things quickly. And then we will get back to actually roleplaying. But, so, back to actually role-playing now. Um, we have this semi-truck here, which I have bought, and we have those quads and side-by-sides. I think you guys know where I'm going with this. So we're gonna load this beast on first, because this thing's going on the top, because if I don't put it on the top, it ain't gonna fit. So, yeah. We're gonna show this bad boy on the top. This thing has a lot of kick. For being a side-by-side, -side, it's got a lot of kick. So I have to be very careful when I load this thing up due to the fact that it has a heck lot of kick when you drive it like this. So slow her down here, boys. Alright, just barely tapped it right. So that bad boy is on there. I'm going to strap it down real quick before it goes flying off from me driving things on. So yeah, we're going to get these guys all loaded up. And those quads actually have coolers on them because either it was a cooler, a gun rack, or a storage box. And I would rather have a cooler on there because if you're taking a quad, you most likely are either going to be using it on the farm or you're going to be using it camping. Now, most likely with those quads, you're going to be taking those things camping because you're not going to use a quad like that. You're not going to be using a 6x6 quad around a farm. I mean, I would probably be the one to do that, but highly doubt some of you guys would be the ones to do that. So, I might not be able to fit another quad on there. I could be able to fit, uh, not a quad, a side by side. I might be able to fit a quad, though. So, yeah, I don't actually have a purple one. I got red, orange, yellow, green, and blue, and then we would have gotten purple, but... I didn't have any purple ones, so we're gonna roll with black instead. So yeah. Some of these will be sold, others will be kept. Okay, these guys might have to go sideways on here. Luckily, they're pretty light, so I might be able to fit them all. Just by picking them up and shoving them on there. Alright. I would personally say that works. <laughs> Some of you guys might not agree, but I definitely agree. You know? Um, did I just strap down in the bed then? I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, actually I did strap it down. Never mind, I got her shut down. So we're gonna lift that bit up and we're gonna shove everything else below it. <laughs> nope, wrong, wrong thing. I gotta like figure out the controls on this. There's the controls. There she is. Couldn't figure it out. They didn't have any instructions. <laughs> so I'm thinking we're going to shove this bad boy on first. Now luckily this thing, these things don't have as much kick as the razor does. Maybe in the future we'll get more razors. What do you guys think? But for now, we're going to have one razor. <laughs> 
And, yep. Can you fit in there? Please fit, please fit, please fit. Ah, oh, she doesn't fit. So shit, this guy's gonna have to go back. So we're gonna just kind of leave it there. And then we will, first of all, fix that strap. As I know that that strap is broken. So there we go. So we're gonna just kind of like chuck all this stuff on sideways as well. Because, yeah. I'm a YouTuber. And this is Farming Simulator. To be exact, modded Farming Simulator. Even these quads might not fit under here. Dang. Even these things might barely even fit on here. Oh yeah, baby. That one's gonna have to go a bit sideways, most likely. I think that's the best it's gonna get. And yeah, I'm probably not gonna be able to fit all this stuff on here correctly, so we might have to do a second trip. Unless we really just finesse this stuff to the maximum, which naturally, that's ability that I very much so have being a Farming Simulator 22 YouTuber. So naturally, I might be able to do that. Alright, <laughs> let's strap that one on too. This is what happens, guys, when you give me access to stupid. I might be able to fit everything on here. And again, I might have to finesse some things, but if I have to finesse some stuff... It's going to be pretty easy peasy if I do. Alright, I think that's going to work. That'll be good enough. Just saying. think it'll be good enough. I just strapped the bed thingy on, didn't I? <laughs> so smart. But, <laughs> is there a strap here? You know what, screw it. I'll strap that down later. <laughs> I keep forgetting how the rainbow goes. I was, I kept think, I kept saying this on my head. Red, orange, yellow, green. Okay, yeah, I gotta go green next. Uh, I keep forgetting the alphabet, man. I'm not good with the alphabet. All right, peoples. All right. Okay, this is gonna be a very tight squeeze. I might have to shove this thing on the back of the one on the top. So that's what we're gonna do. Cause naturally, that's what we do here in um at Bunsen Science. We be stupid. Basically what we do for a living. I get paid to be an idiot. And strap the bad boy down and yep. Alright. <laughs> that is the most realistic thing you will find in a while, guys. Oh, buddy, I love this already. See, this is why I like to be a farming simulator YouTuber, because you can finesse things and be really stupid. Naturally, every single farming simulator YouTuber has that capability to just be stupid at some point in their life, you know? You know? You get, you, you're picking up what I'm putting down. Yeah, we're gonna triple strap that bad boy. And fold her on up. And strap her all down. Alright. Let's um take this bad boy home. I might need to put down my other axle. So, how do I do that? I don't think I can do that. Oops, I'm trying. Nope, 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 nope. Guys, it wasn't me. I didn't do it. I didn't make the trailer like this. There we go. She's fixed. Here, maybe if I detach it, it'll work. Nope, she don't work. Wait. Still doesn't work. We're gonna just have to suck it up. And try our best. Because that's going to be pretty hard for me, to be honest. I'm probably going to hit a few people when driving this beast. So, I'm going to turn on my hazards before that happens. Drive beacons on the snow. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that. Yeah, that's that's an actual horn from like an actual semi that I just... We're going to have to swing real wide. Like, real wide. And hopefully I don't tip when I swing real ride. Alright, we're good. So, oh, never mind, we're not good. We are not good. Never mind, we're good. Alright, I'm never doing that again. Oh, this thing does have some plus. You did not know that. Alright, quickly, guys, we're gonna go play the pistol. Some plus. Pretty nice. Pretty nice, I like that. So you guys, this is what happens when you give me simple IC. 
I go crazy. I do like this though. Do like that. Gives it that little bit of. I don't know to be honest. All right. Um. Let's back this bad boy off first. I probably can turn off my hazard lights now, but I'm gonna leave them on just in case. But I kind of have to arrange this how I like it. And I don't know if the razor is going to fit through that door now that I'm looking at it. So if the razor doesn't fit through that door, then that's my new side-by-side, -side, I guess. And that razor might be, for now, my daily driver. Did not mean to pick that thing up. Alright. I'll open the doors after we get everything in here. Um... I think next we're gonna go a bit out of roleplay here, picking that thing up. But I need to make sure that this thing fits. I need to. This is like the most important piece. Okay, yeah, it's gonna fit. It might actually be shorter than the can to be perfectly honest. Oh yeah, baby. She's a beaut. She's the best thing I've ever seen. Oh my gosh, I just hit a pole. You know what? Maybe just so I just never have to drive this thing again, we're gonna just shove it there like that and just not move it. And if we have to move, we're going to pick it up like that. <laughs> but I'm thinking we're going to put this guy, like, right here. It's like that center piece. Like that center showroom piece. Um. I think we're going to leave that for a bit longer. And we'll get this guy off. We'll get those guys off left. And then afterwards, we'll hop back in the truck and shove it away. I don't know if I'm going to shove the semi-truck in the back because it kind of like takes up a decent amount of space and I don't really want that I'm thinking over here is gonna be side by side so I'm thinking rather than having this as the center piece we're gonna kind of shove it just right there perfect maybe we'll shove it a bit more this way so that we can actually have it look. there we go and then now it's quad time and these bad boys are going to be the ones who get picked up because they're going to be a bit annoying to drive off of the trailer if we were to drive them. So, we're going to shovel the quads over here. And we're going to go kind of like red, orange, yellow, green, blue. Like rainbow kind. It's so red, orange, yellow, green, and blue. So we got orange. Luckily, these things are light, or else I would be breaking my arms right now. Red, orange, yellow is next. Kind of just going to scooch this thing up as far as I can. To kind of give it that nice, like, lined up feeling. There we go. And then we'll get yellow. And, okay, never mind. I strapped it. That is a sight to see, everybody. That is a sight to see. It's beautiful. I need to get a photo of this really quickly, guys. We're gonna go to roleplay a lot in this video. I just really need a photo of this. Because this is too funny. This is just too funny. To not get a photo of. I'm sorry guys, we're having a quick intermission here to be for me to be stupid and have my stupid moment. Cause I just I just have to. I can't not. Oh yeah. Alright guys, we're all good. All good. Just all good. Sorry guys, that was a quick intermission. I really needed to do that because I needed to save this moment. And I gotta enter this vehicle to unstrap stuff okay 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 we're good we're all all good all good we're gonna have to tab through these things aren't we this is what happens guys when you're me this is what happens when you're me and you're being stupid all right you got that oh my jesus lord of god okay oh my lord did not mean for that to happen Okay, yellow. <laughs> I'm gonna just act like that never happened, alright? Just never. Never ever happened. 
So we're kind of going like two to an area here. It's so like red, orange, yellow, green, and then we got blue and black over there. Now it's gonna maybe collide with the side by sides, but so we're gonna get green next. And then we're gonna deal with the monstrosity that's over there. Um, boom. That looks pretty good. How about these guys? Do these guys look good? You can scoot forward just a bit more. Alright, yeah. Time to deal with this. I just don't know what I've done here. This just confuses me sometimes. Oh, I keep hitting that stupid thing. Also, guys, I might not be able to get rid of the EXP customs thing on this. So if I can't, you're just going to have to act like it doesn't exist. I'm going to get Optic to maybe do it. Also, shout out to Optic for doing those signs over there. Because those signs actually... I don't know if I said that in the video... The two videos before this. I think I said it in the Chevy video. But... I can't remember if I did. But shout out to Optic for making me those signs. He also made me that dealership building right there. So, yeah, Optic made, Optic did a lot here. So I might try and get Optic to help me out. Because he's a great guy. Amazing dude. Very nice. And he will do basically anything. Because a lot of the time he's bored to death. <laughs> Optic, I'm joking, I promise. <laughs> but, yeah. This is probably the best it's going to look in a while. Because after this, a lot of these are going to get sold. I have a feeling what's going to sell the quickest is these quads. Like, these quads are, like, the best camping setup ever. And, oh, baby. Does that look better than ever? Look at that, boys. Alright. So, let's do that. We'll put you down... And we will turn off my hazards, and I do kind of need to close that door. That actually worked. I'm surprised. We're going to just kind of shove this around back because it's not going to fit in the back. It'll fit in the back, but it's just going to take up too much room. So we're going to kind of shove it around back here. Now that it stopped raining, I could probably take everything out of there. But for now, I'm going to just leave them in there because it's easier to. Because I'm lazy. Yes, I'm lazy, I know. But I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!